What's up, everybody? It's your boy Corey, aka GQ Saint, back with another reaction video. Finally, Death Battle, Core versus Storm, Avatar versus Marvel, X Men comics. So, curious to say, I did not choose a side. I decided to just go and remain neutral. And this was just too much to think about. Because Storm controls manip manip manipulate all weather, whereas Core can control all elements. So. I was kind of leaning towards Coral, but who knows what might happen. You know, Death Battle is known for pulling off surprises, especially for a lot of people who they're fighting against. Anyway, don't want to bore you guys and listen to have on in. Most of I try to drop this video either tomorrow or Wednesday. Don't want to say hey, T. That was my T. She is camera shy. <laughs> I know someone who ain't camera shy. Come here. Come here, girl. Come here. Roll my mic. Say, hey, Storm. <laughs> Does she want to go Monty now? Okay, yeah, another mayor of my family. Anyway, let's go on dive on in. You are no special quest. Comment below. Let me know what you react to. Let's get it. Meite never was one of her strong suits. Your powers are impressive, but you lack discipline. <laughs> True. I'm the Avatar, master of all elements. You want to see for yourself? Of course, Avatar. I'll show you what an X-Men can do. <laughs> Say Omega level mutant versus a fully realized avatar. Uh, come on, Cora. <laughs> hey, she's a water tribe member, so water is definitely her strongest element. She can metal beam, the storm can't do that. Spirit realm. Where am I? Who are you? I don't know. These must be all the losers from the previous death battles. I'm curious. I think I saw Ken. They had a one battle Ken versus Terry from uh, Fatal Fury. Well, King of whatever. Street Fighters. Yeah, Ken, Ken lost that fight. Answer me! Break of nature. Gotta get out. Gotta get out. Scott, Jean, Logan. I won't let you down! <laughs> yeah, cabbage man the spirit world <laughs> I just feel so bad for this guy trying to sell cabbages in the spirit realm you're no bender the avatar state She's a avatar state. Her powers amp amplify a lot. Also, the most vulnerable. If they're killed in avatar state, the avatar will cease to exist. Ah! 
Rava. She is the source, the true source. Mm. I know what you are, Spirit of Storms. <laughs> exactly. Are you serious? Oh man, I'm glad I remain neutral on this. Man, I did not expect that at all. Oh, they, yeah, they got to come a good explanation for this. I like both on the steel. Oh man, but some people gonna get mad on this. This fight wasn't totally straightforward. Cora can tell yeah. those fighters pretty easy with their rough ending power and martial arts skills, especially with the Avatar state. Not even some of the best benders on the planet like Zaheer and Kubira could stand up to her at her best. However, despite Korra's awesome Avatar powers, she found herself outmatched by Storm's skill, precision, and overwhelming force. For instance, Storm's massively hypersonic flight and ability to sense and control weather across the planet meant she could always fight safely from a distance. Korra's trained in martial yeah. arts from birth, but even if she did manage to get in close and fight hand to hand, Storm's experience with the X-Men and defeating Callisto meant she could keep up. While Korra may have fought people who can dodge lightning, Storm can dodge literal beams of light. Even just using her flight speed exiting the atmosphere, she'd still be nearly 20 times faster than Korra. Korra hmm. did have yeah, I figured she had the speed like advantage. Earth that Storm didn't. If she somehow found out about Storm's claustrophobia, she could theoretically trap her in some rungs to exploit it. But Storm would be more than powerful enough to just break out. Her lightning was strong enough to match Polaris, who punched a hole in the Earth all the way down to its core. Yeah, ultimately, Storm was just way more powerful. Remember that planet-sized storm she created? Well, I know clouds are lighter than air, but those are a shit ton of clouds and need a lot of work to move around. By measuring their volume and the speed at which they move, a storm. The storm they say potential she she is now potential. She is an omega level mutant. About 250 times or it's figured that given the amount of power she possesses. This is the same woman who was powerful enough to reignite an artificial star. Results like that aren't outliers. Even taking the fight to the spirit world wouldn't have helped, considering Storm has manipulated alien weather from outer space and alternate dimensions. <laughs> yeah. She'd have no problem adapting. I remember I read that comic. Storm's powers are genetic in nature, not spiritual. Korra would not be yeah. able to depower her with energy bending. Yeah, none of that is counting the ways Storm could yeah, so that's very right true. the bat, like sucking the air right out of Korra's lungs or generating a lightning storm in her brain. Korra was a tenacious, unrelenting opponent, but Storm's massive range, precise control, deadly skill, and unbelievable power won her this fight. Don't get bent out of shape. Korra just couldn't weather the storm. The winner is Storm. Good fight. Who's next? Madara, okay. I'm pretty sure this is season finale. I'm more excited for this. Madara Uchiha versus Sosuke Aizen. Naruto versus Bleach. Two com well, two combo series from their second generation to bit three. Oh yeah, I'm ready for this one. Okay, pretty good fight. Well, like I said, I'm more excited for this next one. <sighs> I kind of like matter a little bit more than Aizen. The one problem I had with Bleach with the anime is just the way they did. I still love the anime was great. Anime. I like the anime. It's just the one thing I really hated what they did with the fillers. Like, I remember I forgot when Ichigo, when they went to Hiramundo, I forget. I don't know how to pronounce it. I never could pronounce it well. They on the way to rescue or he made it just switched to a completely different feel of arc. I, I didn't I hated that. That's why I was like Naruto a little bit more. You cool, Kim. <laughs> you cool, Kimmy, just waiting. Well, I'll tell you later when I'm done talking to my cousin. Anyway, who you think is gonna win in this fight? Make sure you give a like, comment, and subscribe. And fantastic day. Peace.